What is good, everyone? Welcome back to K Nation. It's your boy Uncle K here, and here we are back again with another Hearthstone video. We actually, I, you know, I was taking a break after leveling up here and there, uh, and decided I wanted to try another deck out real quick before I go right back to Pirate Warrior. And I saw something that looked very interesting. Granted, since we're at that little foot home at level uh, level 10, I wanted to at least try out a couple matches with it before I go right back into the works for Pirate Warrior. So, let's get into it. This is what I'm going to be doing. All right. So, here we go. This is my, my build called Dream Druid. It's the same capability for um, as, uh, using Celestial Alignment, but with a couple of tweets. So, look. We got a couple of new in um, intakes. We got the Moonlight Guidance that came from the Dead Mines. That basically allows you to discover different uh, a, a card in your deck, and if you play it, it pulls it from your deck. It's a great way to draw into what you need to do, or when after alignment went off, it's a good way to get copies of the cards uh, to help and to increase your chances of winning. Next, my other changes is Oracle Loon. This is what allows me after a celestial alignment to be hit. It allows me to get multiple copies of minions that are played on the field. This works really well with the next couple of cards that are about to be coming out on the field with. We still got the same combo with Forest and Warrant and the same combo with Gadgets here but, and, our, and Lady Anaconda. But what is the changes? The big change is Mr. Smite. Mr. Smite comboed with Oracle Alone goes for a really hectic kind of gameplay. Especially when you're setting up when you got two Oracle Alone's on the field. Then you play... Uh, Mr. Smite. They give you three uh, Mr. Smite. So you're looking at about what 12, 18 damage. But yeah, wait, that's not all. What if we added in a survival of the fittest? You add in another plus four damage. So plus four, that means this dude's gonna be 10. You're looking at three 10 tens coming to your face. That means 30 damage. So we are running for a OTK deck in standard. It's crazy. I didn't think I could even possibly make this work. But we're going to see if we can make it work. So sit back, relax, make sure you like, subscribe, comment your thoughts, tell me which how you feel, and enjoy the massive welfare that's about to go down. All right, so I think this might be the actual matchup where I can finally get this off like I want to. Yep. All right, so cool. We're gonna be one. We should shoot the draw as fast as possible. All right, the gameplay is going to be fairly simple in this exchange. We're going to be looking to alignment on the next turn. Then we're going to... We should be able to survive at least two more turns, two or three more turns. Because he's in a hurry to get his quest. So if I can pop... If I can get it just right, I can survive with a couple more turns on me. Yeah, he shot OTK I me. Mean, he won't be able to do it when with, with what I'm about to do. Unless this backfire is in my face, but we're about to find out very soon. Alright. So we got 20 cards. And we have at least... Shall I wait one turn?
Yeah, I'm gonna have to do it. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Yeah, we got it. Wow, we got it. Okay, and that solved the game right there, boys. That's how it's supposed to happen. Done and done. There's completely nothing he could do. There we go, boys. That's how it happens. And, you know, it at least take, what, four or five times, four or five matches before we got to that? Exactly! Fun! Fun game! Yeah. Let's keep doing it. We're gonna try to see if we can do it one more time. Alright. There we go. Finally got a decent draw. Oh, jeez. That's a very tempting, because early Celeste alignment. Yeah, I got to. What are you going to be playing, Quest? Shoot for mana. Did he shred? No, he didn't really shred anything good. towards this I might say screw the, the other combination and just go for this 
Then again, I'm trying to OTK, so why am I even bothered with that? He already used both his cards. He ain't better do anything right now. Besides, he's helping me with what he's trying to do. I'm really tempted just to play it like this because it's so tempting. I can't help it. Even if he pops it, he won't be able to get his quest off until the next turn. That's if he gets it popped this turn, which he's not. So then he has to wait two more turns before he can even play his quest. He could just milk the field. Yeah. take that even though it wasn't what I wanted. You really got nothing else to do, so sit back, relax, and just enjoy the music. Should I go for the second one? Yeah. 
Just uh, hold back. We have a decent setup now. Thanks to that, I was able to pull my hands off of for Anaconda. Now the problem is draw. Um, I need to get a bunch of draw. Oh, he's um, that one deck. Hero Paro Mage. Should I even play this now? two turns and then play Celestial. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Bait it. Bait it. Bait it so hard. Now we are set, boys. Now, granted, I can't make my grand... One bow combo set up. If I can make something similar to that. Wow, double frost. Cute. Help me out there, buddy. You didn't use your hero power. Thank 
Thank you. All right. All right, guys. So, we all balls down to uh, Dream Joy. It's not the best stack out there. It's probably one of those that you want to play when you have a little time in between um, these intervals that you go through. Because, you know, turn five, when you hit the rank 10 or rank five section, that's when you have a like a breathing period. Where if you want to play these types of decks just to, you know, have fun, you can do that. Now, unless you're really trying to climb the ranks, I wouldn't do, I wouldn't advise to do these types of things. But it is fun to try some of this stuff out before getting back on that that run uh, to say but yeah in the end I this this is my take for it I changed a couple stuff around as the game went around like added and uh, took out one Luna uh, took out one archer tier added in some armor up and took out the 10 costs uh, it was a couple stuff here and there it still was fun it was fun I had fun granted still a bunch of aggro but like I said it's not meant to climb the ranks uh, it was meant just for fun so, I hope you like the video. Hope you enjoy. You take care. Peace.